Well, Tramel Tillman, what stars as Milchick on the hit Apple TV Plus series Severance, and the cast just got nominated for Best Ensemble in a Drama Series at the Screen Actors Guild Awards. First of all, congratulations, and thank you for chatting with me. Thank you so much. Thank you. It's such a delight. Let's talk about the last episode of Severance. Obviously, a lot going on with Milchek, with Harmony, with Heli. I mean, there's so many questions that you got left with. Um, tell me about this period of like having to wait for, you know, answer those questions and getting ready for season number two. I mean, it's been agony because <laughs> I want to know what happened. You know, when we received the uh, final draft for the final episode of season one, I was reading the last few pages and I said, you cannot end it this way. This is not fair and it ended that way and so i have been eager along with the fans trying to figure out what is going to happen in season two and um i it's been a delight to be able to film it and we're still in the process of working on season two now well i mean before we start getting talking about season number two we have to celebrate season number one we're getting ready for this big award um tell me a little bit about how you're preparing uh, your outfit that you're going to wear, the parties you're going to go to, what you might say if the cast wins. I mean, tell me a little bit about what these weeks leading up to the ceremony is going to, what's like, what's it like for you? Listen, I just have to remind myself to take deep breaths because I've been going to so many award shows and wearing these wonderful clothes that my stylist has been absolutely incredible with. And, and it, just walking these rooms and being in these rooms with these incredible artists that I've watched for years. Um, so, we're in preparation. I'm in preparation to get ready for the SAG Awards while filming. And so it, it's been a process, um, but I'm just reminding myself, you got to breathe and just enjoy and remind yourself, hey, you're at the SAG Awards and this is this is living. It's life. You know? Oh, exactly. There's going to be so many amazing people there. There's going to be so many festivities taking place before and after after parties, you know, pre parties. Are you planning all that out as well, too? I'm going to go to any party that I'm invited to. <laughs> you sound just like me. <laughs> and if, if I have to have my list, own I'm party, be there. yeah, if I have to have my own party, I'll do a own, my own little melon party by myself. <laughs> Let's talk a little bit about what the series, um, you know, means to people, because obviously with a lot of people working from home and a hybrid model, those lines between work and home have really gotten blurred. And this series really resonates with, with so many people. Yeah, I mean, the show is so much about balance, right? And we're working so hard to figure out what that balance is. How do I leave work at work and life, life? And, you know, the main character, uh, Mark, is going through a period of bereavement. And so he is undergoing this procedure to kind of get away from his grief. You know, I, I feel that this show is so, um, it resonates so well with audiences because it is applicable. We all can understand that to be able to compartmentalize in different ways. Um, but this, this show speaks to the human condition. Um, it's also funny, it's weird, it's dark. Uh, so it, it's such a delight to see how the fans have responded to it and how smart they are about dissecting it, you know? As far as the cast goes, as far as the team working together, is there kind of those blurred lines where sometimes you have to laugh at each other as far as like, we're off, you know, we're not on set, but here we are talking about it outside of work. Like how do I can see you laughing that obviously. Yeah. Comes up. <laughs> I mean, this ensemble is fantastic and they're such great people. Um, and it's such a reward because this show is so heavy and you're paired with people that are such a delight to work with. So I laugh because I'm often thinking of the times where we're sitting backstage goofing off with one another and telling each other random silly jokes or surprising each other with riddles or you know having our own inside jokes and building that own family, our own camaraderie. Awesome, well, we can't wait for, for season number two. I think it's coming late, later this year or early next year. I, I don't have an answer for you, but I do know it's coming. It is coming. I promise you. They're filming it right now. It is coming, you know, but hopefully exactly. we'll, we'll cross our fingers and we want to celebrate season number one. So youtube.com slash Netflix, where you can watch the SAG Awards on Sunday, February 26th and stay tuned for Severance season uh, number two coming to Apple TV plus later, uh, later this year or possibly early Thank next year so much and uh, much success and can't wait uh, to see the awards and uh, crossing my fingers for you and the team. Thank you so much. I appreciate right, have it. Have a great one. You too.